Hello everyone and welcome to a quick video today where I'm going to tell you how to create your own custom searches within Google Chrome. Now um, just if you don't know what one of these is, if you just open up Google Chrome and uh, the best example is say searching YouTube. So if you just type YouTube in the address bar and press tab, as uh, many of you will know it will come up with search YouTube video search and you can search for a video uh, within YouTube. So uh, yeah, that's just a standard built-in uh, Google search, but if you want to make your own to search for any website, it's uh, pretty simple. All you have to do is right-click and press Edit Search Engines. And as you can see, there's uh, an option down here to enter a new search engine. So uh, I'm just going to create an example search for you, and for this I'm going to use Amazon. So I'll just head over to Amazon. I'm just going to type in a search query. So if I were uh, just type in something really random, I don't know, um, just book. And I'm going to copy the URL just into Notepad in case you can't see it very well. So we've got the URL here. And uh, what we want to do is we want to find everywhere it says book in the URL. In this case it just says it once, in some searches it might say it twice, but what you want to do is just change it to percent %s. So that's Shift 5 for percent and %s. That's all you have to do. And just copy this URL again. And then go back to the search engine tab. Just in case you're wondering why we put percent %s instead of anything else, that's normally where the search query goes. So this is where Google Chrome will put in whatever you're searching for instead of percent %s, but it needs to know where to put it, so that's all that's for. Uh, anyway, now I've just briefly explained how it works. If we just type in what we're searching, so Amazon, we need a keyword, so what to type in to start this search. So I'm going to just use uh, AMZ and paste in the URL. Just press OK. And let's try this out. If we just open a new tab, type that out and press space. As you can see, it uh, uh, says search Amazon. And now we can just search for anything. So uh, this time, suppose I search for Kindle instead of book. And as you can see, it now searches for Kindle. So that's uh, a really quick example of a custom Google Chrome search. I hope you enjoyed this quick video. I really hope it helped you on this uh, basic Google Chrome tutorial. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, it really helps other people find it and gives me some feedback. So uh, thanks again, and see you in the next video.